Hey, what's going on? This is Joey T. We're at training camp here in Green Bay. And Sean McQuillan, your local fanalist in Green Bay. Welcome to training camp, Joey. Hey, Sean. Good to see you. All right. <laughs> We're here at the Ray Nitschke Field having a good time. The fans are great today. Everybody came out during the week. Um, let's see. What can we go over first? We're not going to cover the Martellus Bennett. Well, you know, the guy goes to his locker to sleep. <laughs> the real question is, why? Was he not? Was He's he tired. late? That's was he why. late? Did he not have a door room or what? I mean, this is like one of the best guys in the offense. Well, it's been a great day here at training camp. Got a chance to walk around, do all my badge scans. Haven't won anything yet. Uh, come <laughs> out tomorrow and Saturday. You can still go around scan. And the September first is the uh, drawing to win something here. Is it? But uh, the first day of training camp, it's awesome out here. We got about three minutes till they throw us out of here. We can't wait. Let's Joey, let's talk a little bit about what stood out to you today. Anything in particular, offense, defense, what, what were you seeing? Well, on the offense, I, I'm, I'm big on Jamal Williams. I think he's just smooth as can be. Uh, I love the way Ty Montgomery, uh, his footwork looked fantastic, fantastic, excuse me. His cutting was incredible. I don't know if you recognize that, but uh, recently he, he ran into a guy uh, Rashad, I, I can't think of his last name, but he's like the footwork king. He worked with Melvin Gordon last year before the 2016 season, and uh, he's also worked with Ty. And uh, that's that's what really, to okay. me. I, I would say on Ty Montgomery, Ty Montgomery looked really good in the uh, no auto. That's where I think you're really going to see him thrive this year, and uh, looking forward to it. I think, you know, you're going to see them in the no auto like you see every season. The offense looks really good. Um, as far as a standout that I saw in offense today, I'd say Devontae Adams is definitely going to yes. be, I think he started to break through last year, but I see him definitely uh, having a huge year. And uh, every time he touched the ball today, it was awesome. Caught the one bomb down the field. Wasn't that great? But uh, just looks really sharp, really good. Definitely playing for a contract, but uh, uh, good for the Packers. Yes. How about defensively? Anything you noticed there? You know, oh man. Not much really stood out to me, but I, I'm still high on Jordan Tripp. I, I think that kid, he's got good speed. You know, I'm talking about players that maybe aren't as common or aren't as popular. Uh, I like looking for that. Sure. Um, but he was one that I thought, you know, he's just got the build and he's got everything going for him. I'm excited to see what he does okay. this year. How about yourself? I was really focused on the secondary when mm -hmm. they were uh, running their scrimmages. And, uh, you know, the, as far as the cornerbacks, I still seem a little concerned, I, you know, from what I'm seeing. <laughs> uh, looking, at the, looking at their number one draft pick, King, looks like he's good in coverage. Uh, looks physically, looks a little small, you know. So I, I see him uh, having to put on some size to, to be just he's got to put on size is what it looks like. But uh, looks good in coverage. One pr player that really stood out to me uh, would be the uh, Josh Jones, the rookie safety. Uh, Absolutely. He definitely has great size. You saw in the 3-4, they put him in the linebacker's position quite a bit. Look for him to probably start to uh, phase out Morgan Burnett in a lot of situations. If you can put him as linebacker, that's a big plus. Looks yeah. like he really understands the defense well, so I'm excited about that. One play I recognize, too, uh, Kentrell Bryce, when Allison was going for the one pass. It's like, you hear that guy, they must hear footsteps, because he's a hard hitter. Mm -hmm. and. Uh, you know, he's, he's talked about in that regards, sure. but he's not really talked about as a starter. But uh, I'm also curious to see how he does this year. Hopefully he can uh, step it up a little bit more because, man, he can hit. And oh, yeah. so. Allison and uh, Davis both look, both look good in the offensive mm -hmm. scrimmaging also. Look for Davis in punt returns. And, uh, yeah, I'd say overall, there's, you know, that's, a, that's about what I saw for highlights. But uh, just a great day to be out here. Great day. All right. Well, thank you very much, and uh, thanks for tuning in. Thank you very much.